The entire time I've been conceal and carry and I've always used an inside the waistband holster. I find that they conceal better than outside the waistband holsters, but they're often not as comfortable. I carry a handgun all day, every day, and oftentimes it gets very uncomfortable throughout the day, so I've very much been considering outside the waistband holsters, and I know that they've been getting better and better as time has gone by. So I started looking and on an online forum I stumbled across a few people that recommended a company called Privateer Leather. I reached out to them and told them I was considering an outside the waistband holster lately and they agreed to send me one. What they sent me was a Highwayman pancake style holster for my CZ variant from Switzerland. I've been looking for a good concealed carry holster for this pistol and I think I just found it. The craftsmanship in this holster is beautiful. You can tell that a lot of time and detail went into the production of this holster. What I found as I carry it is again it's not as concealable as the inside of the waistband holster but wow I can tell a huge difference as I carry that thing. Six days a week I wear a suit coat so it's really easy to conceal it whether I have outside the waistband or inside the waistband as well as it's a fairly large pistol holding 18 rounds in a double stack. The fit of this holster on my pistol along with the stitching is quite exceptional. It's also a very lightweight holster. What I have found if I go between one holster and the other inside the waistband and the privateer leather outside the waistband holster, I can definitely tell the difference on comfort. If you're looking to upgrade your comfort level on concealed carry, I definitely recommend taking a look at privateer leather. I'll put them in a link in our website at godfamilyguns.org. If you like this video, click like and subscribe. And again, you can also find us at godfamilyguns.org and godfamilyguns at Facebook, but by far, the most important part of this YouTube channel is it's a ministry to us and we take prayer requests. So please don't ever hesitate to send that stuff in. Thank you for watching this episode of God, Family, and Guns. And as always, love God, love your family, love guns.